Well, hi, and thanks for stopping by the Pellets and Pistons Air Gun Channel. Today's a pretty good day for me. Uh, I just got back from Baldwinsville, New York, where there was an air gun show uh, that I went to with a friend of, our, uh, friend of mine. And uh, while I was there, I, I saw some really interesting stuff. And I also picked up um, three uh, rather wonderful, wonderful rifles. Um, the first uh, is a HW Model 50S with the uh, stainless steel look, which I believe is just nickel plating. And uh, this gun is uh, custom stocked with a Steve Cochran uh, ambidextrous stock, so it's great for a lefty like me. Uh, I can shoot this just fine. It's got the custom swept back trigger, which I believe is from Rowan Engineering out of England. And it's just a sweet shooting little rifle. Somebody tuned this thing and they did a wonderful, wonderful job. So take a close look at this. This is a gorgeous rifle. Next up, we have a Webley Longbow. This is a beautiful rifle that somebody customized. They put a, a swept back trigger in it. Um, they checkered the factory stock, which came out absolutely gorgeous. They, they did a fantastic job. Whoever did that is a craftsman, to say the least. Uh, it's just a beautiful, beautiful rifle. It's got a really high luster blue on it. Now, Webley's famous for their bluing, but I think this gun was reblued to an even higher luster. It's just absolutely stunning. Um, <clears throat> ported muzzle brake on it. It's just the, whoever went through this gun really did a nice job. The trigger on this rifle, it's a Webley now, remember that. But the trigger on this gun is phenomenal. It's really, really sweet. Uh, I can't wait to get some trigger time behind this rifle. So uh, have a close look at this beauty. And then we'll move on to the final gun that I picked up over the weekend. All right, lastly, we have up a Theoban, or Theoban, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, uh, Eliminator. This is a really heavy, heavy gas ram rifle, uh, but it's also very, very powerful. It's a 25 caliber. I'm not sure what it's producing for velocity, but we'll figure that out in a, in a couple, upcoming video when they, we do bench tests on all three of these. We're going to uh, really get into them and figure out exactly what they're capable of. Uh, but this rifle right here, you can tell when you go to cock it. Um, I'm getting estimates between 55 and 69 pounds of cocking effort to cock this gun uh, when the ram is set at maximum power. Maximum power gives you a, a, an output of somewhere around 30 to 33 foot-pounds of energy. So it's no slouch, that's for sure. It's got a factory moderator on it, um, and it's just a gorgeous, gorgeous rifle. So have a close look, and, uh, and um, I think you'll see for yourself what a beautiful, beautiful gun this Theoban rifle is. All right, so that wraps it up. That's the three new guns that we picked up at the Baldwinsville Air Gun Show in upstate New York. Um, and just to, just to celebrate, we're going to go ahead and ring the bell. Now, I've recently torn, this is self-diagnosis, but I'm pretty sure I have a mild tear in my right rotator cuff. And that's the, the arm that I usually use to uh, cock these rifles. Um, and this one here is no slouch when it comes to cocking. Like I said, it's, it's probably somewhere up over 50 pounds of cocking effort. I'm going to attempt to do that with my left hand because I want to ring that bell with a 25 caliber pellet out there at 60 yards. So let's see if we can't get this gun 
uh, ready for firing. Oh my goodness, that's a workout. <laughs> 25 caliber pellet. Right now, it doesn't really matter what brand I'm using. I, I can't even tell you. I, I just grabbed the first 10 or 25 caliber pellets that I found. But uh, we're just going to reach out there and try to ring that bell. What a beautiful rifle. Glasses. All right. The scope does not belong in this rifle. <laughs> that thing really hits with authority, doesn't it? So anyway, that's the uh, the three rifles: the uh, um, HW50S with the custom Steve Cochran stock, the um, uh, Webley Longbow that's been highly customized. What a beautiful, beautiful rifle that is! And lastly, we have this uh, Fieldman uh, uh, Eliminator rifle in 25 caliber. Fantastic! I'm so glad I went to the show. I never would have picked these up otherwise. And I want to thank you folks for stopping by the Pellets and Pistons Airgun channel. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And by all means, hit the bell to be reminded of future videos. Thanks again, folks, and have a great day.